welcome to this episode of What's in the Box? Okay, so we got a box here. What's in the box? I'm not really talkative right now. My sugar's low, so. Diabetes. <laughs> Diabetes. So we got this box. In, so there was a claim sale in our group. Mm -hmm. And normally the claim sales we would pick up at the group meetup. But everything's canceled, so there's no... There was no group meetup for the month of April. And there won't be one in May. Yeah. So, our buddy Jason Norick, we've claimed from him before. We bought from him in the videos. Mm -hmm. Had a claim sale and we bought some things for very good prices. Mm. But before we show you what's in the box, we're gonna have a little bit of a bonus thing. Cassie was shopping for her boss. Mm -mm. No. She was just doing work. She well, was shopping for work. Yeah. I like she to was, word it that way. She was shopping for work. And she picked up something for herself. And there's glare. <laughs> because I didn't turn on the camera light. There we go. Boba. The Pops, giant, enormous Pops Boba Fett. If you can tell by my head, which I have a giant one. Huge. I think the 11, 11 inches? You should wear your Boba Fett helmet with your Boba Fett Pops. Maybe. But yeah. 40th uh, Empire Strikes Back yeah. size. And uh, so if you don't see them at your Target, like if you're going there and doing your essential shopping or whatever, I'm not judging you. Um, they had this one in the back. I went and checked their location because I was like shopping for work. And uh, I walked up to the kid that was working at the, the counter and I was like, I know that you guys are super busy and I hope I'm not bugging you, but I was like, I don't see them over here, so I don't. I know sometimes you guys put them in a different location. Uh, he said no, they actually had them in the back because they're so busy stocking the essential items right now. Uh, they didn't have a lot of time to put them out, but they did have them in the back, and he was so he was very willing to go get it for me, which I appreciated, and I couldn't turn it away, so I got them. Yep, that's the third thing we've gotten at Target recently where it was in the back. Yeah. So you gotta ask. Well, don't be dicks though. Right. I mean, we we asked multiple times for Red Hulk and they never had it, but yeah. they're always super nice though. But yeah. we also weren't dicks, so. Yeah, I got the Black Widow Target exclusive. It was in the back, and then when we found the Evie for her friend. It was in the back. Mm -hmm. So that's that. All right. So now on to what we came for. Mm. Here, let's put him. Down. What's in the box? I'm still eating, so. <laughs> Let's open this bad boy up and see what we got. Jason works so dangerous at this claim sales. He is. We always buy a lot from him. Almost, almost every time. Last time there was a meetup. We didn't actually buy anything from him. And he's like, what's up? And we're like, yeah, he's like, what? I had everything. <laughs> I had everything you were offering. 
And then I bought I, something from him. I missed that claim sale though. Oh, did you? Mm -hmm. I, I saw it. I did not. So. Well, he's done a very good of pecking. Which, this is a tiny box. For everything we bought, I thought it would have been in a much bigger box. And he was like, oh yeah, I'll ship it for free because he spent so much. And I was like, right. you're sure? All right. Oh wow, he did a very good job wrapping this. Everything is all bubble wrapped and... <laughs> Brownie points for you. A plus job, Jason. All right, let's you open up this one. I believe that one is one of yours. There's so much freaking tape. I think. One oh. of these things is Jason's. Our friend Jason had his thing shipped with our stuff, too. Oh, and it's, so he not only wrapped it in bubble wrap, but he put it in another bag. Too. He's a superstar. And, and I can't wait to pop the shit out of this later. Oh, it's so tiny. Okay. Yes, bitch. SH Figure Arts, Darth Maul. So tiny. Yeah, I thought this would be a little bigger, but I'm not complaining. No, this is cool. And for the price that we got him at, and the price the, that he's going on the, for like Ibe. Oh yeah, the detail Ibe. if you can see in his face. Yeah. Let me see if I can get it to focus. They're really expensive. Oh yeah. I missed out on the Jangler though. Yeah, he had, he, he had like nine or ten of these, but... I swear, if, he, if they're so expensive, set, I'm pretty sure he had like 98% of it. I'm not sure on how many of these there are for Star Wars, but... I don't know, I really like the Darth Maul. It is cool. I thought it was a bigger one, like the 12-inch Legends, but that's still a really cool, really nice figure. Mm -hmm. Very, very nice. And we have, oh yes, this one's one of mine. Jeez. He extreme taped this. I wish I was more energetic right now, but that won't be for a while, I'm sorry. And... Boom! Heavy hitter is coming out fast. Scarlet Spider from the Rhino Wave. I could not believe he posted this for the price he posted it. I'm like, not on camera because there's, I'm just going to move this box. And as soon as I saw this, I didn't even look it up. I just typed in C-L-A-I-M. Claim. Wow. Oh, yeah. Because the rules of claims are whoever like types claim first underneath each picture because the, <clears throat> the picture has to have the price the picture and then you know obviously comment section on and then you whoever claims first then gets that item they can't unclaim yes um so you have to be very careful and you have to choose wisely but at the same time you have to be really quick because a lot of people going in on these are like ready mm -hmm. so he also posted the chameleon for a for like 60 which it goes for a hundred on amazon and someone else claimed it right away it goes a hundred on everywhere right macari but, amazon well, ebay i based the costing off of amazon that's just how i do it but Evil bay. i got him for like 50 bucks and he's like an 80 dollar figure on amazon and the thing is is we're also supporting local people yes i mean i'm gonna keep saying it <laughs> Because I'd rather give somebody else money that has these, that has collected these, taken care of them, and I, um, but instead of, you know, huh. not saying that on eBay that you're not, you're not supporting huh. somebody, but this it's... This one's interesting. It's just, yeah. It's not Kane, it's this, this one, this Scarlet Spider is Ben Riley. Hmm. That one's Kane, though, the other one. Hmm. Didn't know that for this figure. All right. Ready? Next up. Okay. Another one of mine's. He taped. Can you 
he ever... I am not cutting towards you. Cutting this way. I'm not going to cut you. I'm terrific. <laughs> it is extremely tasty. All right. This one is the next biggest one we got. It's like we pulled them down from biggest to smallest out of this box. Nick Fury. Mm. Like Giant Man. We, had him. we have the Sam Jackson Nick Fury. We don't have the Hoth. <laughs> the white one. <laughs> Yeah, this is the original Nick Fury. The one we have is from the movies, but it's also his son. Mm. Junior, basically. They don't call him that, but... This is only the second from this wave that we've gotten. But it's still a pretty good figure. I like it a lot. Unless it's Captain America. Oof, there's not room out here. Awesome. Oh, it's got different helmets too, so you can switch these other guys. It doesn't have to be Nick Fury, it can be other S.H.I.E.L.D. agents. It's funny because the one helmet reminds me of Halo. Yeah, it does a little bit. A little bit like Master Chief. Alright. Next thing to come out. You hit the truck. Right. Oh, next thing to come out is a Cassie. And then this one's me. Oh. And there's Jason. Okay. Imperial Death Trooper. Oh. You take it. Three three minutes. quarter black inch. I don't normally buy these. Not normally. Um, but that one's cool. Yeah, I really like this one. It was a decent price. I was like, okay. They need to make him in six inch. Yeah, that would be cool to eat. If they haven't already, I don't. Th I don't think they have. I didn't start collecting these until I joined the group. I think, right? I'm gonna say September of last year. She started collecting these. Yeah, so I think a month or two before that, I joined the group. Yeah. Something like that, but because I didn't know they were a thing, I never really looked at them in the stores, and especially when Toys R Us was around, because like I I collected the like Amiibos and stuff like that. Um, but other than that, I wasn't really, I was more of like a, a gamer instead of a collector, so. Mm -hmm. All right. The last legends of the hall. Jeez. If you watch I'm this, Jason, later, yeah. <laughs> good job. This was an excellent job of I'm wrapping. Like, <laughs> and this one I didn't claim at first, but I went back and claimed it because I was waiting to see if something else had dropped. But I didn't have it, so you have the Symbite Spider-Man from the Sandman wave. Really need Green Goblet, right? No, we need a bunch from that wave. Oh, no. But I this have how much I don't know what we have. Right. I have the Symbite Spider Man from the Kingpin wave, so I was like, eh, I want them both obviously eventually, but I don't didn't need it right away, but then I decided to pull the trigger. Guys, I can't but, wait till we get a house. Ugh. But we the ones that we don't have on here is Green Goblin, a Spider Man twenty ninety nine, and Jackal. Because we have the UK Spider Man, we have Miss Marvel. And we have Shocker. Nah. Yeah. But that's another one to add to the collection. And then I'll show you guys what Jason got. Did he say you can? He won't care. Okay. I just, I'm. They don't know who Jason is. Oh, oh that's cool. Yeah. Bitch. Basic. A little plastic case. It's a really nice case, actually. I really yeah. like those. I definitely mm. prefer the Black Series cases, but that's really cool. Yeah, Ultimate. Plus, like, look, it's got the little boobies. Yeah. The boobies. The unpunched card in there, that's really nice. Mm -hmm. That's a really nice figure right there. Yeah, let's be very careful. Yeah. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, the picture he posted doesn't do this justice. I'm gonna have to message him later, be like, dude, this thing is sweet. But I'll put this back in the box because that goes to Jason. And he was just here. He was actually stopped over to pick up some stuff we grabbed for him and he was dropping off our crossbones. If when you'll see that in yeah. the last video that he picked that up for us and then I was like, dude, check this out. He goes, Oh, claim. So because even though we're trying to stay distant from everyone and everything, um, when we do our shopping like normal or for work or whatever, then we always still check the toy out. Right. <laughs> Dumb not to, you're there anyways. Right. Absolutely. So then we so always look out for each other too because uh, luckily that's what we like about this group. It's like it's it's easier to get things that we wanted. Um, but we also put in a lot of work to do it for each others too. Sorry, one of us fell on yeah. Alright, so that's the whole what's in the box. I'll do a little quick view of everything and that'll be it for this video. Thank you for watching. Alright, there it is. That's what we got in this claim sale. I know y'all don't have claim sales everywhere, but I'm telling you, find those Facebook groups, join them, get in them, see what they do. If you don't have one in your area, start it. Why not? Can't hurt nothing. If it goes nowhere, it goes nowhere, but it could blow up and be an amazing group like the one we're in. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next one.